Well, I've been asked two questions regarding turquoise and I thought it would be best to answer those two questions in a video. If anybody and everybody out there is not interested in turquoise and where it is found and you don't want to see any turquoise, turquoise mines, you won't be interested in this video. And I'm going to uh, read those two questions verbatim now. How abundant is turquoise in areas that one would hunt it? And how much could someone find in a typical day? The answers to those questions, of course, are how the bloody fuck would I know? Um, the abundancy of turquoise depends, of course, on how much has been found and how much is left to be found. Uh, one can make estimates, but nobody knows. Uh, one can make estimates on how much gold is out there. Nobody knows for sure. The problem is all the easy turquoise has been found. So I thought, let's take a tour of the turquoise in San Bernardino County, California. Asking the question, how abundant is it? The answer is, nobody knows, but we do know there's a jolly hell of a lot of it out there. We have at least one entire mountain made of the stuff. We have an entire region in the uh, same area that we know there is a hell of a lot of turquoise left there because a hell of a lot of turquoise has been mined in the area. The problem is, of course, all the crap that buries the turquoise. Uh, we know it could be anywhere from an inch or so to several hundred feet. Your guess is as good as anybody else's, even geologists, when it comes to going to a known area that has turquoise and looking for turquoise that has not been discovered yet. It is a crapshoot. You may as well toss a coin. Anyone interested in finding turquoise, the place to go, of course, is where other people have found turquoise. Down here in this video's description, I have a URL for a map I created showing the turquoise mines in San Bernardino County. There is also a URL for a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet for turquoise mines in the database, the um, United States Geologic Survey produced and produces where one might find turquoise because it's been found there previously. Note that the database lists turquoise mines as not just merely turquoise as a commodity or the ore, but gemstone. So there can be many mines out there that produce turquoise that are not in the database because turquoise is not listed. There's also mines turquoise mines that may not say that they have turquoise in them because they're listed as gemstone mines. So, now that you know where the turquoise has been found previously, let's go take a road trip to some turquoise mines. I'm just a girl I'm just a girl in the world So, we are out here looking around Middle Camp, which was once a very successful turquoise mine. As you can see, how the bloody hell does one wander around with a shovel and find a spot to dig and find turquoise? It will not be easy, and if you just start digging, it's very unlikely you're going to find a new spot or prospect, let alone a mine, that has turquoise. What you want to look for, of course, is an outcropping, a ridge, or even a rock that has been thrust up from below that bears turquoise. Lots of luck on that also because all of those upthrust and ridges and uh, outcroppings have already been examined and there won't be any new ones for thousands and thousands of years. 
The solution, of course, is obvious. You talk to a person who has a turquoise mine claim and you ask to buy it from that person. Or you can find a claim that is no longer claimed by anybody and file on it. Also, once again, lots of luck on that. Pretty out here, ain't it? It's a lot like lush tropical Hawaii. Bring water. A good idea to stay out. Bye, golly.